thick. Then you really start feeling yourself. <laughs> like, I ain't. I'm that girl. I'm that girl. Period. What is going on, guys? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Quetta J. And if you are new here, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe so you can keep up and know what's going on with your girl. Yes, and turn on those bell notifications so that you know whenever I post. It's gonna be a get ready with me video. This is the final. <laughs> If you're interested in seeing how I got this look, hair, makeup, and everything, then just keep on watching. So we're gonna start with the hair. This is an old Bantu knot out. I'm just not feeling it anymore. I was gonna wear it out, but after I worked out, came back home, looked at it. There's a mirror behind me, that's why I'm doing that. Um, it needs to be washed, all that stuff. But I don't have time because I'm going out to dinner tonight. So I'm like, let's do a cute little puff, you know? So I'll show how I slick my hair, stretch hair, old twist out, blow out, bands or not, whatever, into a puff. So first thing I'm gonna do is wet my hair around the perimeter. Just to put some moisture back in there. I look into your eyes, I see it. You're all I need. Every time I get a The first thing that I will be using is some shea raw, shea butter. stretch band I'm not really sure what it's called okay so what I do is I put it around my neck twice and then I just slide it up Friends, I like to pull out the little curly little cubes on the side. I use a style factor, edge booster, the EBIN as well. Into your eyes, I see it. You're all I need. 
we go and then it's time for makeup we are fresh and clean okay so now it's time to get into this makeup my face is cleansed so I usually after I cleanse my face I put my eye cream on it's the Monet eye smooth cream so I typically I like to use my hands dab it in the middle of my hand but then I also have an eye roller that comes with it I keep it in the freezer so I will further, I further smooth it in with this. So first things first is, let me tell y'all, no skincare is complete without eye cream because the eye is the shallowest layer of the skin. And because of that, it tends to get worn out and start looking old first. So that's why a lot of people can tell if someone is older by their eyes because that's one of the areas of the skin that is the shallowest and starts to show signs of aging first. So therefore, you always want to make sure you have a really good eye cream in your regimen. All right, we'll go ahead and smooth that in. Oh, I love it, it's so cool. I do have to invest in the lip treatment. I want to try the one that Janae Barbre uses. That's my girl. She's a fellow YouTuber. She recently hit 1K and then shot up to 2K subscribers. So I'm so happy for her. Shout out to you, Janae. Um, okay. Let me put something on these dry lips. I'm just using some Carmex, y'all. Okay. And then, put that kind of sat in. I have my face oil that I also kind of use as a primer. It's uh, the Monet again Rejuvenique Oil. Rejuvenique Oil by Monet Intense. They have a light version, but this is, I guess, for people with, I guess, drier skin. That's why it's called intense. I don't want to call light, but put that all over my face. I love it. These products are vegan as well, guys. And this oil has so many uses, over a hundred uses. It's really the bomb.com. You can use it anywhere you know, hide your face, cuticle oil, for scarring, I mean, it's really, really nice. Ooh, love it. I can literally get lost in doing my skincare life. So my eyes are closed, just enjoying the skin, soaking it up truly is an experience. Look at that. She's greased, she's oiled, she's... So now I will be going in with my foundation. It's going to be Born This Way Too Faced and it's the color Coco. So yeah, this is the foundation that I use. I always get compliments when I wear this foundation. I like it too. Uh, this is like my second bottle, so clearly I like it. This is actually a brush from Ulta. Brushes for Ulta. This is 
is a medium coverage. Give me that. Yep, medium to full. I'm good. It's right there. <laughs> medium to full coverage. Okay. <laughs> Eyebrows, okay. Forgot to do those first. One, I don't even do makeup plus, so yeah, there's that. Let me let me handle the eyebrows just a little bit real quick. So I have the spoolie, and I'm actually gonna use some more of the edge booster. I got this trick from Lex Closer. I really should have done this first. Well, first we're gonna Kind of brush them out. Get a nice little shape going. You know. It's about time for uh, me to get my eyebrows done too. Pretty much everything in the Waxing, all that good stuff. Okay. Then we're gonna add a little bit of the edge moisture. It's only the two of us Everything I need between those thighs Every time I look into your eyes I see it I have the brown I get a bit inside, I feel it. Oh yeah, oh yeah, babe. My concealer is Pro Concealer LA Girl in the color Toast with my e.l.f. concealer brush, professional concealer brush, so I'm gonna just actually use this is a Mary Kay foundation brush but I really like the way it, it like because of the flatness of it and I'm probably so wrong please don't come for me the makeup professionals and gurus I just do what I like and what works for me <laughs> but yeah I use this brush to kind of like blend it out We not done. 
Now it's time to bake. It's time to bake. Do you like cupcakes? Because it's time to bake. Mm-hmm. You see how as you put makeup on that confidence just it then you really start feeling yourself. You're like, hey. I'm that girl. I'm that girl. Except my concealed areas with actually I'm keeping it old school. The Ben Nye Topaz. Yes, that is what I use. or highlighted I use the Sephora it's Sephora's like pressed powder don't even know the color anymore because I got it a little while ago and yeah so and I use the same brush I used to apply the Too Faced the liquid foundation and I just blow in and and a little makeup set that my mom had got me some years ago. I don't know what the rest of the pieces are. This is the only one that I have left. So yeah, you know, you just slide it up. And right now I do need to get some more blush. So I've been using the Fenty Lip Stain Uncensored and I'll use this. And I'll just kinda, it's so strong, which y'all already know. I just kinda put it here. I dab it a little bit out with a napkin so it's not so harsh going onto my face. And then, it's even still a lot, see? But I do love blush. You never have enough blush. I just rub that out some more. <laughs> oh, she rosy today. Let's rub it out. Child, we gotta calm her down. Whoa, I did not mean to do that much, y'all. Okay, we're gonna get it right. Don't worry. All right, so now I'm just gonna go back in with my foundation brush just to calm down some of the blush that we got going on. It's actually a bronzer from Forever 21, but I use it as like a little highlight. It's just bronzer from Forever 21. I use this little angle brush, Wet n Wild. Black 
the mascara is Clinique as well in black. store I'm pretty sure this is from there in the color Bahama beige I forgot the setting spray. So this is called Spritz to Fix Beauty Supply Store once again. I actually went to the store to get this for this video and forgot to put it on. Anyway, it's um the dewy finish because I have very dry skin. And I like the dewy finish. More than likely it might not look dewy because my skin is so dry, so it's just gonna give it that right amount of moisture, but First time trying it too, so we'll see. Mm, feels good. Smells good. Ooh. Make her look real. <laughs> natural beat these earrings are actually Ralph Lauren I got them as a Christmas present from my parents and this necklace is forever 21 and this bracelet is Burlington Coat Factory so this is the final look guys I hope you enjoyed I might do an outfit check Okay guys, so this is the outfit that I'm wearing tonight. These faux leather leggings, these are from Hollister. This top is from Abercrombie and Fitch. You already know, I used to work there, I know. And then this bag is from Forever 21. And these shoes are from Rainbow. So yeah, I just wanna show you guys the outfit. And oh, the scent of the night is, is Good Girl. 
jeans. This one is sexy out here. And just in case I get cold, got my little jean jacket situation. I'm never so this is the look. See you guys live. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching this. Get ready with me. I hope you enjoyed it. Leave a comment down below if you want to see more content like this. And we out to date night. Here we get.